the Grand Slam. Simply amazing. Welcome back to the Longevity Deprocess channel. Great news is that many foods, um, uh, including foods that we mix together, and this is the whole point about food synergies, activate our body's health defenses. So the Grand Slammers uh, that I write about in my book are a, a series of foods. And by the way, that list is growing because, you know, you can only put so much in a book and the research continues, are foods that activate all five health defense systems at the same time. And so just like a Grand Slammer, you know, like in baseball, you're, you, you know, it's a home run and everybody gets driven around the bases to home. Um, so you score big time. That's what I call the foods that actually really knock it out of the park. Dr. Lee just enlightened us about his Grand Slammers foods, a remarkable collection of ingredients that bolster all five off the body's defenses. Among these powerful foods are coffee and dark chocolate, both of which will feature in three delicious smoothie recipes. These recipes will include only Grand Slammer ingredients, ensuring you get the maximum health benefits with every sip. Before we dive into these recipes, let's take a moment to introduce the brilliant mind behind this groundbreaking Grand Cashier, Dr. William Lee. Dr. Lee is an internationally recognized physician, scientist, and author known for his revolutionary work in the field of angiogenesis and diet-related health. His extensive research has led to significant advance in our understanding of how specific foods can influence our body's natural defense systems. Dr. Lee has authored two best-selling books, Eat to Beat Disease and Eat to Beat Your Diet, which delve deep into Toth concept of Grand Slammer foods. These books provide a comprehensive guide on how to incorporate these powerful ingredients into your diet to fight disease, promote longevity, and enhance overall health. In his work, Dr. Lee has identified how these foods can support the body's five key defense systems, immunity, angiogenesis, the process of forming new blood vessels, stem cells, the microbiome gut health, and DNA protection. His research has opened up new possibilities for disease prevention and health optimization, making his insights invaluable for anyone looking to improve their diet and wellness. Oh, a quick favor, we'd greatly appreciate it if you can subscribe and like. This helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content and share it more widely. Let's hear from Dr. Lee himself as he shares his insights on one of these grand slammer foods, dark chocolate. Now I'm going to throw one last kind of delight and surprise that can help your stem cells, which help to rebuild your brain and your heart and your muscles, actually is dark chocolate. Turns out chocolate's a candy. Okay, it's a confection. But to make dark chocolate, you have high amounts 70%, 80%, 90% cacao. Cacao is actually from a seed pod, the cacao plant. And that's a plant-based food. It turns out there's natural chemicals, bioactives in cacao made in dark chocolate at high concentrations that help our stem cells come out and rebuild our muscles, our circulation, many other parts that need to be renewed. And as we get older, one of the things we want to do is we want to continuously be renewed rather than broken down. These are some of the ways that we think about diet and longevity. Which includes all dark chocolate. Let's turn our attention to another grand slammer, food. Next, Dr. Lee will enlighten us about the remarkably benefits of coffee and how it contributes to our overall well-being. A study was published in the journal Annals of Internal Medicine of 171,000 people in their 50s living in the United Kingdom, and it showed that those who drank two to three and a half cups of coffee per day had a 30% lower risk of all-cause mortality. That means death from any cause. The people came from a database called the UK Biobank that has a half a million people participating, and the study took place over nine years. So what's in coffee that is so beneficial for health? Coffee has a natural chemical called chlorogenic acid that does a lot of things. It improves your blood flow, stimulates your own stem cells to help your organs regenerate. It improves the gut microbiome, which lowers inflammation and improves the metabolism. It's an antioxidant and chlorogenic acid also improves your immune system. What's even more interesting is that organic coffee has more chlorogenic acid than conventionally grown beans. Is that a dark roast I smell? Dr. Lee just talked about the health benefits of coffee. All our smoothie recipes feature these two ingredients, both dark chocolate and coffee, along with other ingredients from Dr. Lee's Grand Slammer list. Our first recipe will also include green tea, another potent ingredient. Now, Dr. Lee will share the incredible health benefits of five additional ingredients that are in our first smoothie, which are also Grand Slammers. 
Who hasn't heard of the benefits of green tea? We know tea has polyphenols, they're called catechins. We know one of the catechins is called EGCG. It's actually really, really good for you. Not only does it cut off the blood supplies to help starve cancers, not only is it anti-inflammatory, uh, not only does it help protect your stem cells so you can regenerate from the inside out, the, the, the fiber in green tea and some of the catechins, the catechin itself is actually a prebiotic, helps to nourish your, nourish your gut microbiome, take your gut bacteria, make it happy, it's antioxidant, good for your DNA, stimulates your immune system. It turns out when it comes to your body fat, the catechin actually fights white fat. It actually helps you actually lose some of the subcutaneous jiggly stuff. But more importantly, it actually helps you lose visceral fat, the harmful baseball glove fat that can be trapped even inside a skinny body. So the bottom line is that green tea drinkers just metabolically are healthier. Next. Grand Slammer ingredient. Check this out, kale, right? Kale is a brassica. It contains uh, healthy bioactives uh, like isothiocyanates, hard to pronounce, ITCs. They uh, create sulforaphanes and the things that make broccoli take, taste kind of sulfury. Uh, but it's really good for you. It's good for your immune system, good for cancer fighting, good for your circulation, good for your gut microbiome. Most of these uh, uh, kale has rich dietary fiber. You always think about kale as one thing, right? Like this. Always think about kale looking like this. That's your mother's kale. Let me show you some really cool kale. This is a kind of kale called Laxinato, also called dinosaur kale. Does it? This look like dinosaur skin? Check it out. Jurassic kale. That's what this is. All right. Lacinato, it's also called Cavallonero. A lot of people don't know, but this kind of kale, dinosaur kale, is what's used to create minestrone soup. You know those little black um, uh, little squares in the soup floating around? That is dinosaur kale. Uh, Lacinato kale, Tuscan kale is in the kale. Now, I want to show you something that is more unusual. So I haven't seen this before. Spigarallo kale. Look at this. Spigarallo kale. Wow, very different, huh? Look at that, it looks like a arugula almost. Um, but this is a kind of kale, and it just shows you how many different types of healthy foods there are. Look at this right here, All right? Looks like, like grow under the sea or something. Healthy, good, good for you. Now, our next Grand Slammer ingredient. Our telomeres are getting shorter and shorter and shorter and shorter. Remember that powder keg I was telling you about? When you get down to the powder keg, man, game over, right? You can't run away from that blast far enough. And so basically what you want to do is slow that fuse down. It turns out that sunflower seeds can actually naturally slow down telomere degradation. And another Grand Slammer ingredient. And our final Grand Slammer ingredient in our first smoothie. Hey there, I wanted to share with you one of my favorite fruits. This is a peach, one of my favorite summer fruits. Juicy, you can smell the fragrance. The peach actually comes from Asia. Uh, actually was transplanted and transported along the Silk Road. And it's got chlorogenic acid. This is actually a bioactive that uh, actually does a lot of things. It um, cuts off the blood supply to tumors, it actually helps to protect stem cells, your health defenses. Also good for gut health, and it's also got a good amount of dietary fiber. Uh, but the interesting thing about chlorogenic acid is it actually helps your metabolism by fighting body fat. So you can activate your good fat and fight your bad fat using chlorogenic acid. Plus, it's just a juicy, great fruit to select during the summer. What you want to do is you want to smell it, and it should actually smell really good. And by the way, Yellow peaches actually tend to be a little bit sweeter and juicier than white peaches, but white peaches are also delicate and great. Dr. Will Lee out. Now, we'll walk through the full recipe. All the smoothies in this series are easy to make and only feature ingredients from Dr. Lee's Grand Slammer list. They all follow the same simple instructions. One, brew and cool the coffee. Two, add all ingredients into a blender. Three, blend until smooth. Four, serve chilled and enjoy let's start with our first recipe dark chocolate coffee green tea smoothie ingredients one cup coffee cooled one half cup dark chocolate pieces or cacao powder one cup brewed green tea cooled one cup kale fresh one tablespoon sunflower seeds one tablespoon extra virgin olive oil 
one half cup peaches fresh or frozen. Did you want this smoothie? Now, let's move on to our next blend. Dr. Lee will introduce us to blueberries, a key ingredient in our second smoothie. Discover how these powerful berries enhance the flavor and nutritional profile of our next recipe. Just by eating like a cup and a half of blueberries um, uh, uh, a day, you can uh, elevate your uh, T-cells by like 88%, okay? Um, and athletes that actually eat uh, blueberries regularly, they just walk around with a higher level of immunity to begin with. Now, let's shift our focus to another powerhouse ingredient in our second chocolate coffee smoothie, pumpkin seeds. Discover how these nutrient-dense seeds contribute to the delicious and healthful blend we're about to explore. Sprouted pumpkin seeds. Now, pumpkin seeds are actually a traditional uh, food uh, snack, actually, in Spain. Papitas. And these are sprouted, and I'm going to show you Here's what they look like. I'm going to try one. Mmm. Really good. Good source of dietary fiber. You've got polyunsaturated fatty acids, which is good for the microbiome. Um, so is the fiber. But what's really interesting is there was a study done with almost 4,000 people showing that um, those people, those women eating pumpkin seeds, actually had a lower risk of breast cancer by about 34%. Pumpkin seeds are up to nine cents a pound. Now, let's unveil our second smoothie recipe. Two, blueberry dark chocolate coffee smoothie. Ingredients? 1 cup coffee cooled 1 half cup dark chocolate pieces or cacao powder 1 cup blueberries fresh or frozen 1 tablespoon sesame seeds 1 tablespoon extra virgin olive oil of 1 tablespoon pumpkin seeds Homemade smoothies Discover how these ingredients come together to create a delicious and healthful blend that supports your well-being Next, Dr. Lee will discuss walnuts, an essential ingredient in our final smoothie recipe yeah, you guys, some of you have seen these, these are the walnuts. Yeah. Walnuts are some of my favorite. Walnuts have actually been shown to improve your immune system by activating, feeding your gut microbiome. And when that actually happens, it actually makes your body respond better to uh, med medicines. Specifically, the study was done in patients with colon cancer, stage 3 colon cancer, getting regular cancer treatment, um, including nuts in their diet, actually lowered their mortality by more than 50%. So here's an example of something that your doctor's not gonna prescribe, but that I would actually encourage you to eat if you're battling cancer, feed your gut, improve your immune system, help your immune, your own bodies to help defenses fight disease. And of course, a uh, good healthy immune system also prevents diseases uh, as well. It's a walnut. And another grand slammer ingredient, Dr. Willie here. I want to show you a fruit that is worth knowing about. These are plums. Look, there's a whole basket of them. Now, plums have a bioactive called ferulic acid. Ferulic acid improves your circulation. And studies in the lab have shown that it actually decreases neurodegeneration, which can actually improve cognitions. Now, let's reveal our third smoothie. Three, dark chocolate coffee, lychee smoothie. Ingredients, one cup coffee cooled. 1 half cup dark chocolate pieces or cacao powder 1 cup lychee peeled and pitted, fresh or canned 1 tablespoon walnuts 1 tablespoon extra virgin olive oil of 1 half cup plums pitted, fresh or dried A grand slam Discover how these ingredients blend together to form a flavorful and nutritious smoothie, brimming with health benefits these blends harmonize the robust tastes of dark chocolate and coffee with nutrient-rich components, ensuring each sip is both delicious and beneficial for your well-being. Feel free to adjust the amounts to tailor the taste to your liking. Please consider giving us a thumbs up, sharing this video with your friends and family, and subscribing to our channel for more valuable content on health and wellness. Your support enables us to continue delivering essential information to assist you in leading a healthier life. Thank you for watching, and as always, I wish you excellent health, wealth, and happiness, with the key to vitality in your hands.